It is Friday, January 9th, and all good things must come to an end. Today marks the final day of the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas. Our Mike Yanni has been on the ground running for the past six days, bringing us the hottest tech from the show floor. Mike, you must be exhausted. I'm a little tired. I'll admit, I'm a little <laughs> tired. But, you know, running on adrenaline and, of course, finding the cool things on the show floor, it keeps you going, that's for sure. But bittersweet, happy it's over, but a little bit sad as well. But you know what? I saved some cool things for today, Tara. Um, and one of the things I want to start with is something that's been a huge talking point in the show, drones. We've been talking about in the studio mm -hmm. for weeks, if they not scare months. They me. And they are every... I, they kind of scare me, yeah. too. Uh, and they're everywhere here. And you know what? In fact, there's one just up there. This is called Air Dog. This is really interesting, Tara, though, because this one is built for extreme sports specifically, so it can shoot 4K video, four times the resolution of HDTV. But here's wow. what's interesting. Look at what's on my wrist. I've got something called an air leash. Now, it follows me wherever I go. It's autonomous, so watch. I'm gonna take a couple steps this way, and it follows my movements. I'll walk back the other way. Isn't that crazy? It is crazy and creepy. <laughs> So yeah, you throw it up in the air, and whether you're surfing, mountain biking, skateboarding, anything like that, it goes up to 45 miles per hour, recording the video, following all your actions. I like it. It's winning awards on the show floor for good reason. Pretty cool stuff. Mm -hmm. some, some people are like, you know, it's a little bit scary, I guess, thinking about soon there could be drones everywhere, um, but still, pretty cool. It's a pre yeah, okay, pretty, yeah, pretty neat. Uh, now, I know it's a little bit cold outside in Calgary right now, but uh, imagine in the summer, sitting in your backyard, having a party, and having some laser projections like this shining through the trees. This company is called Bliss Lights, and I may get in trouble for this, but they actually create laser shows for Disney. But now they're doing it, so they're packaging up small laser projectors so you can have it in your backyard. So this is one of the pixie animations here, but there's tons of different animations. They can do constellations and stars. You know, we see them at Christmas time, but imagine now they're going to have them in the summer, uh, so you can have a high-tech party, and uh, it's pretty classy. Uh, we've seen a video of where they shot in L.A. and had them at events, and it looks really slick. In fact, the shopping channel show, uh, sold one during the Christmas, uh, which you probably drove some past some houses in Calgary this Christmas that you saw the pinpoints all mm -hmm. over the houses. That was from the shopping channel and that was bliss lights so expect to see more from them in the future now do you have a green thumb i can't remember are you me green thumb or no. brown thumb brown black even brown <laughs> yeah yeah okay yeah. then you're going to like this this is called the parrot pot there's a prototype here on the show floor the idea is it's a smart flower pot it can keep your plants alive with you having to do nothing well one thing you all you have to do is use the app tell it what plant you have and then you sit back and relax because it monitors the sunlight, it monitors temperature, it monitors fertilizer, and it waters your plants for you when you're gone. Huge! So no excuse anymore to keep the plants, uh, yeah, your plants are always gonna be alive. I love that, I think a lot of people are going to buy that when that comes out for sure. Really cool stuff. Okay, this one's not coming to Canada, but I had to show it anyway. This is called Akka. This is a smartphone from LG. It's the world's first smartphone with a real personality. There's characters inside each of the phones. So watch when I shake them, their eyes go all googly. The characters actually live inside the phone and then to switch characters, you can actually swap the backs out and the characters change. There's also augmented reality. You can, when you take photos, they sit on your shoulder and things like that. Really neat stuff, Akka. It's not coming to Canada, but I had to show you because a lot of people are talking about it. Now, I want to quickly end with Canada because uh, a lot of Canadian companies on the show floor and this innovation is from Spin Master Toys, based out of Toronto. You know the Meccano brands? Oh, yeah. Up with its, Absolutely. Uh, fun stuff, right? They're bringing it back. This is the new Meccano. This is Mechanoid. So you build him. He's got about 200 pieces, between two, 300 pieces. But the neat thing is, you can program him to do whatever you want. Or you can even build a dinosaur out of him. You can build different things. But hey, I'm nerdy, and I don't know how to code. So to program them, you just grab the limbs and move it around hit play, and it mimics exactly what you've done. Uh, they've won awards on the show floor. And Tara, I think it's only appropriate that I give the last word to, Mac, um, to Mechanoid here. He has a message for you. Goodbye, Tara. Goodbye, Calgary. Yes, <laughs> a big goodbye from Las Vegas. Magic Guy Mike Yanni, uh, thank you so much for all of your coverage. I just want to know very quickly, how are you going to spend your last 24 hours in Vegas? Yeah, Sleeping. right. No. <laughs> <laughs> chance. You'll sleep on the plane. Not a chance. All right. Sleep is for the week. Yeah, no kidding. All right. Thanks, Mike. Thank you for all of that. <laughs>
Thank you. <laughs> I want one of those mechanoid sets.